Hey guys, it's Vicki. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a what sold video. It'll be for the week of February 11th through today, which is February the 17th. So for today, I have already tallied up everything. It is only 9.32 p.m. So I still could get a few more sales before the end of the night, but I wanted to go ahead and make the video just because I'm impatient and I have nothing else to do. <laughs> so, all right, um, so far for this week, I've had $600 in sales and I have made a net profit of $440.12. I have sold 31 items in all, and I did send out a lot of offer to likers. Um, I did, I think I gave a few people free shipping, so that is why um, the amount is so low compared to the sell price. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through and I'm going to tell you each item that sold this week. I will put over here, a photo of the item and it'll have the price that it sold for as well. All right, so the first item that sold is a Torrid polka dot chiffon pin tuck top. I made $10.20 off of that. The sell price was $15. The next item is J. Crew Factory Suede Diorce, Dorce, somebody correct me. Um, pumps and it sold for $28. I made $22.40. The next item is a Cole Haan Nike Air black leather sandal. These were excellent condition and I literally got them from the bins. So this was an amazing sell right here. Um, I sold them for $36 and I got $22.01 net. The next item is an Old Navy green bell sleeve t-shirt. Well blouse, whatever you want to call it. It sold for $11 and I made $6.25. I got that from the bins as well. The next item is a Sam Edelman metallic wedge sandal. I sold those for $36 and my earnings were $22.01. The next item is a Pure Bar Gray Racerback Tank. I sold it for $12 and it was an earnings of $9 and I made $9.05 off of that. The next item is a Madewell Drop Hem Chambray Denim Top. I sold it for $15 and I made a $12 net profit. The next item is a Lily Pulitzer Take Me to the Beach Marielle Sweater and it sold for $20 and I made $16 off of that. We have an Onzi Black Sparrow Print Legging. It sold for $18 and I made $12.60 off of that. The next item sold for full price that I asked for. It was $28. It's a loft gray pinstripe vest and I made $22.40 off of that. The next item is a Haas Entropia Sparrow Print Skirt. It sold for $28 and I made $22.40 from that. Then I sold a Torrid Green Thermal Long Sleeve Top. It sold for $17 and I made $13.60. The next item is a Trip New York City Checker Capri. I sold it for $10 and I made $7.05. The next item was a Hard Rock Cafe New Orleans T-shirt. I sold it for $7 and I made $4.05. The next item is a Hot Ice Bob Marley tie-dye t-shirt. It did have some holes on the armpits, which I listed in the description. It sold for 10 bucks and I made $7 off of it. And you have to excuse me, I just went through a coughing fit, so that's why I had to edit that out. <laughs> so now I'm all clogged up again. All right, the next item I sold was H&M button blazer, a uh, button-up blazer, and it sold for 10 bucks and I made 705 off of it. Uh, Lily Pulitzer Pink Fontaine Bell Sleeve Top. I sold it for $25 and I made $20. A uh, Vera Bradley Kensington Tote. A uh, Vera Bradley Kensington Tote. It sold for $13 and I made $10.05. A uh, LuLaRoe Floral Carly Dress sold for $14 and I made $9.25. A uh, Coco and Capers sweater cardigan sold for $13 and I made $10.05. A 
an Anthropology Porridge Duo Aztec Pattern Skirt, sold for $33, and I made $24.60. Another Lula Row dress, um, it's the Julia dress, it sold for $14, and I made $11.05. Um, the next item is the Soft Surroundings Orange Tunic, uh, it's like a sweater. And I sold it for $28, and I made $20.60. And is it just me, or is everybody else getting super confused since they changed the shipping prices? Like, I'm, I'm, I was used to, I had already memorized all the pricing, and now I'm having to memorize it all over again, and it's like really screwing with me. But anyway. Alright, the next item is an Anthropology Knitted and Knotted Brown Cardigan. I sold it for $30, and I made $24 from it. And the next item is a Denim and Supply Ralph Lauren Floral Dress. I sold it for $27, and my earnings were $21.60. Um, this is one of my sales from last night, and it was a Some Days Lovin' Peggy Sue High Waisted Flare Jean. I sold it for $25. She had offered $20. I countered her to $25, and she accepted. So I made $20 bucks off of that. And the next item is a Vera Bradley Windsor Navy crossbody bag. It sold for $12, and I made $7.25 off of it. And then I'm down to two more items. Uh, Banana Republic Camden Fit Paisley Button Down Men's Shirt. I sold for $10, and I made $7.05 from it. And then a Ralph Lauren uh, Denim Ruffled Button Up Button Down Top for a Little Girl. It sold for $10, and I made $5.25. I think it was a pretty good week. Um, I probably shouldn't have given out so many offers, but you know, I know how much I paid for each item. So if it was going to affect, you know, my profits, I would not have um, sent them out. I do overprice my items most of the time, just a little bit, just to give me a little leeway to um, drop that price for uh, to equal out the amount that I want to sell the item for. So yeah, I think it was a good week. Um, if you want in the comments let me know how your week was in sales did you sell a lot I've heard a lot of people complaining that they're having a really slow sales week but typically those people who complain about that have really really good weekend sales and this weekend has the sales were not very good for me like I I did okay yesterday I think I sold about 120 yesterday um, net profit which is good um, but like today, I think I've had two sales today. So today wasn't really good compared to most Sundays. I do pretty well on Sundays, but this weekend was a little backwards. So, all right, I will talk to you all later. Um, I just posted a video earlier. It was just kind of like a Poshmark private offer secret video. Um, if you haven't watched that, go take a look at it and let me know if you already knew about it. Um, but yeah, I think it might help people get some more sales, um, being able to reset that private bundle offer. So I will talk to you all later. Have a great night. Bye.